Yeah, it looks good. Uh, just make sure nobody's running in with pretty much empty clip like that. Now's the time to organize. All right, everybody's pretty much got, uh, pretty much has two clips, two grenades, and a med kit now. I went through, made sure everybody's guns were loaded. We got a, whoops, a few bits of spare ammo laying around. It's a fantastic misclick there, but we'll make it work. This is the most annoying type of ship, especially with, well, as you can see, all the boxes, lots of cover, and the floor above us is all chained, so they can see through it. So they got the high grounds, they can see over the boxes, we cannot. Making this extra fun. Yeah, most people can see him. Can we shoot him, though? No, no we can't. We can just see him. We can all just point and scream. It's okay. We'll see if we can get a fire from back here. No, probably that box in the way there. There's all sorts of shit in the way. Unarmored people, hug a box. Duck down, duck down, duck down. Bill, you are very weak. Don't care. Duck down. Armored people up front, you're heading in first. And you see him as well. Everybody sees that guy. Wow! Marvelous. Fantastic. I love it. Thank you, game. See, he can see us, but can we see him? Yes. Yes, we can. We knocked him out at the cost of one magnetic iron armor. Ugh. Not the best start. We're low on people. There's many upper floors. There's a UFO up there killing civilians. UFO up there is probably one of the worst things because he'll just burn away at the floor, creating tons of holes everywhere. And uh, because we can't fly, oh, there's another UFO, fantastic. Because there's no way to fly, sometimes they can just simply cut you off completely and you won't be able to go anywhere. Uh, killing them up there will also do the same thing. Like that. Really nothing we can do now up there. That's what the elevators are for. I think the elevator's just supposed to be the alternative way around. Um, not the not the best mode of transportation though, those. They're very expensive to go up and down. Many ten units. Hope for the best here. There's a lobster man on our floor. Sometimes you can get lucky and most of the aliens are all in this starting area. But that UFO is aimbotting or something. I guess he opened the door first. I don't know. I didn't see it. Um, nice. It's okay. You don't need to hit him at all. Aiming is entirely optional. Apparently it's optional for them as well. And Bill... Not able to get any sort of an angle on this guy? Or you can and you're just full of shit. I think he's lying. Hmm. Oh, who's hiding back here? Nobody? I'll take it then. And rookies! Missed. And you are not a rookie. Hopefully you can hit him. Yes, you can. Uh, we killed the alien who we knocked out earlier, and I think we shut down the elevator in the process. Great. We're really trying to, uh, fuck this mission up, aren't we? I was expecting the, uh, the doors to absorb all of the blasts. I wasn't expecting- ouch, the elevator to die too. There's another one! Luckily he's just got a rifle, there's an unarmed one coming in, somebody's dying in the darkness. Shot in the dark, if you will. Uh, no, no, no. I'm gonna shoot the one who... S 
saw me. There was one who saw me, right? I wasn't imagining that. Um. Okay, well, we both, uh, we both see these guys, so let's just shoot at them. We'll just see what happens. Don't think you can shoot them because you got a big box in the way. Uh, that bullet just vanished. Um, and you're useless in this situation. I thought there was an alien down here with us. I thought I saw it. No line of fire, because there's a box in the way. I don't like that. You can see them, but there's no line of fire. It's very irritating. There he is. Ah, yeah, take out that box. Urgh. Bill Greer, you don't have much health. Luckily, the alien's unconscious and disintegrated into the corpse of a civilian. Neat. He decided to uh, cover up under a corpse before passing out. He's like, oh god, I'm fainting. Uh, get covered so I don't get cold. And everybody still sees these aliens up here. There's just pretty much an infinite amount of them. Just keep shooting. This is why I said ammo is such an issue, because it's just, ugh, it's non-stop. Ah, you are so in the way. Hey, we hit one. It's like there's four aliens and everybody sees them, but not many people can actually shoot them. They're all at funny angles. Not the ha ha funny either. The fucking annoying one. <sighs> Take you one step at a time then, if you're not gonna automatically do it, that's fine. Everybody's gonna be using this mission, because uh, it's all or nothing right now. It's uh, very difficult to abort at this point, even if you do. Uh, I believe I had one guy in the previous playthrough who aborted at this stage in the mission, and we still lost the Triton. But he made it to base just fine, so I'm thinking he swum uh, all the way back to base, which is very impressive. He's being shot at by somebody up there. Don't see him, though. Typical. Uh, you're going to want to get cover, because you're not armored. Let's just see if this elevator works. Uh, it might, because it's yelling at me about Snapshot, so that's a good sign, rather than it doing nothing. Nothing waiting on the steps for me, that's a first. Typically there's an alien just hanging out on these stairs being a jerk. Big old bully lobster man. Not letting anybody through. Ouch! I think that was technically a side shot. Well, that's two suits down. From, uh, somebody up there. That we still cannot see. We'll just have to climb up and get him ourselves, then. Oh, wait, we can't. Wow, there's a UFO up here as well. Or Cyberdisc, or whatever they're called, I don't know. The explosive disc thingies. Yeah, no line of fire. At least we see him, though. We know where he is. Right, he's just being a sneaky guerrilla warfare type lobster man. That's my favorite kind. really don't like the situation we're in here. Uh, we gotta blow a hole in a wall or something. 
No line of fire. Just shoot the wall. Just shoot the wall. The wall's in the way. You're annoying, Tom. Tom Morris. Okay, you know what? I'll just blow it up then. That's fine. Tom Morris has grenades. I'll leave it to him to clear it. Very short on troops. It's uh, kind of hitting me now just how many troops I have. Uh, the answer, I think, is five, maybe six. I came into here with like nine anyway, so that's sort of okay. Uh, that's not the same one. That doesn't make me happy, especially since you're unarmored and he's got a sonic cannon anyway. You will die in one hit. Uh, no, wait, we're blowing that up. Hold on. Just a moment. Now, if you drop it, I think that's enough to get the fuck out. Move! Get out! Nope, 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 nope. Get back in, because that's not safe out there either. There you go. Hopefully that clears the walls in there so I can at least move around. Because uh, I don't think... We can walk up here. Yes! I didn't think we could. Uh, and step back. Thank you. Well, that's excellent news. Wow. Uh, jeez, dude. There's like eight cyber discs up here, maybe? I don't know, it's hard telling. Get back in the elevator. I don't like this. You have, like, no health. So even if you do get hit and a bullet penetrates, you're still probably gonna die. And the best you can do is just hang on for now. Yeah. Explosive barrels. It's clear. Oh. Lots of hidden movement. Ugh. Got one. Ho <laughs> ho. Being risky. Whoa. He sees you. guys. Nice job with the explosions, Tom Morris. I think you've done us all a great service. Perhaps there's a lot of smoke up here, though. People are probably going to pass out at some point. Might actually be a concern. I don't think I've... Oh, we're going down here now. I don't think I've ever had anybody just straight up pass out from being in smoke too long. We might have that happen here soon. So many ways, and these are all just like little apartment things, too. Oh, getting a little nervous here. Ow! Fuck you! I was supposed to be safe, you vertically shooting bastard. I didn't think they could shoot straight down like that. And now you're hurt. There you are. Fuck. Double fuck. 
I don't think you're safe. I think you might die. It'd be amazing if you could shoot through that little window. But no, you can't. Get up there, so next turn, we can attempt to fuck their world up. Really don't like this, there's so many people with so little health. Like everybody's moved. And you're all alone down here. This is very dangerous. Alright, let's hope for the best here. He's retreating. And he's gonna go in for a melee. I don't know if that works or not. I don't think so. I'm pretty sure their melee is like ridiculously weak. Yeah, it must be. And... Tom Morris! For the win! Ah! He kicks open the door, shooting, kills the alien. An American hero, and I don't really know how to do this. Um, point blank explosion, I could try to run. But reaction fire, uh, unless, there we go. Maybe Bill then can put that away. Pop out, get an angle, and shoot. No, that, no, too inaccurate. Or, no time units. And no line of fire. I don't suppose you can shoot through that. Whoops. No, no you can't. Oh, yes you can. Ah, don't die. Oh. Okay, well that went a little better than expected. Um, did that alien, uh, like retreat back back there? I don't... I don't like your position at all, lady. That could have gone horribly wrong, but uh, it actually turned out kind of okay. I'm alright with that. And Virgil Conway, I need you to get uh, up. I think this will work. Just up and wrap around, hopefully you don't fall through anything. Get back with the rest of the group, because one unarmored guy alone cannot do much here. Most things only die in two hits. Got rookies attempting to be heroic over here. Uh, our most armored people on the verge of death, both of them. 12 and 13 health. Not ideal. Part of the elevator seems to be broken there, so I have to use a different square. You folks have moved. I need you, though. I think you need to move still. Head up. And carefully navigate. Out. There we are. And the turn there. Hope for the best. Nothing. Head movement getting somewhat short, I guess. There's probably still six or seven aliens. Run across. Meet up with heroic Tom Morris. The Grenadier with, I don't know, something with Persevere, because Grenadier and Persevere, uh, rhyme. Persevere with our Grenadier, Tom Morris? I don't know. I'll come up with something someday. Uh, and then you two. Uh, he's still alive, which is a fantastic sign. The whole, you know, carpet burning thing isn't, uh, making me feel too good. that turn. 
Turns go by fast when you only have a few people to move. Uh, the fire there, I don't think I can go into fire. I'm pretty sure fire hurts in this game as well as most. Um, so we'll just hang out here for a moment. Virgil Conway is on his way. Yeah, he's just gonna hang out at the doorway. You two, why do you only- you have a fatal wound still. How long have you been bleeding? Why didn't you say something? Heal, 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 painkiller. Whoops. Moved on accident. Painkiller seems to have helped, actually. Here, let me give you painkillers. Pain, pain, pain. That didn't help. Maybe I need to actually select a body part. I forget how medkits work. I thought there was a way you can actually increase their life. Okay, I found one of the UFOs. Uh, he is in the lower area of one of the engine rooms. Uh, I had a guy standing here, took a shot hoping to hit. I actually missed and blew up some of the console, which is what that fire is. And reaction fire, of course, killed him. Took two shots to kill him, but... Uh, <sighs> Apparently he survived one shot from it, but the second shot, following, killed him. So that's unfortunate, but at least I know where it is, and we have another guy kind of in the same area. Actually, just down these stairs here. I'm on the upper floors with the armor people. It's right there, so I suppose I could send people down and help out. But Tom Morris, being a American hero, uh, I think I'm going to try to have him get the kill. It's hard telling, though. It's hard to plan things like that. Usually it's just whoever can kill it, kill it. At this point, I don't care who kills it. I just realized she has no ammo. Oh, look, I found them. Um... Yeah, I'm going to need you to hide behind a filing cabinet for now, Tom. And we need backup. Don't care. Nope, you idiot. God damn it. Just taking a peek in all the rooms, seeing if I can find this UFO it's somewhere around here. There's fire, like, the, the scorch marks everywhere. That's the stuff that it leaves when it moves. It just leaves a trail of it, so it's easy to spot when you've got one nearby, but it's hard to tell where it is. Because they can move far, and they fly, and all that stuff. Usually they shoot at you, and that's how you find out. Alright, nice and slow. Come on. Step by step. Shit. Shit! Three shots? Fucking A. Okay, well, that thing spent all of its time in it, so... Fuck, and you have, like, no time in it for anything, Tom. Just stand in front of the door, hope for the best. It'll close at the end of my turn. So you're in better position to handle it next turn. I've got to reload her gun. I keep forgetting. I'll do that now. After you look. Eh, in there. Looks clear. Ah, 
fresh clip so you're not worthless. I think he's in there. Oh, bullshit. Don't give me that. They're down there. I know they are. Oh, hi. Fuck. Time needs help. And you miss. Somebody's life hinged on your aiming, and you missed. Yeah, we're down to, like, four people now? Oh my gosh. Ah! Fuck you. Yeah, I see you, you asshole. Stress, stress, stress. Still nothing in all these rooms, but you gotta check them anyway. Most annoying. Well, we killed the UFO. Captain Crab is missing in action. And a door opened. Somewhere. I don't know where that is. I didn't quite catch it. Gotta be running low, though. Seriously low. Okay. That... I was... Oh, right, he's down in one of these. Okay. So we'll need to backtrack. Bill, continue on. Make sure it's clear up here. Jump down when you can. So many doors! X-ray would be an excellent technology to develop as a, uh... XCOM team. There he is. Thank you, Tom. Very short turns. I think we might be finishing up here. Which is good. Because I want this to be over. Really bad. I want to be back at base. Gotta finish up making armor for everybody again. Gotta get more Aquanauts, because most people are dead. I think there's probably just a couple more aliens. That one is opening doors down below. Should find him pretty soon.
he's not in that one, then he's in this one. Which means we'll get to him much, much later. Uh, how can we do this? Just go across. I think that door may lead me there. Yeah, their turns are getting really short, though. So that's definitely a good sign. Okay, the game's been flashing, I believe, this staircase. This is the northern one. I've actually been heading toward the wrong one. It keeps flashing it. It's flashed it twice now when I end my turn. So definitely something over here. Uh, Tom just couldn't see it because it was probably around the corner first. So uh, we got to get over there and see what it is. Hopefully it's um, an unarmed lobster man or something, but I don't think I'll be that lucky. I'll just have Bill sprint over there because I'll surely need him. Uh, Tom, just be safe. Um, other than that, Marty and the other suit of armor I've got are upstairs. Up upstairs, I believe this is the top floor. Yes, it is. Uh, Top, top floor scouring still. Uh, hopefully I haven't, have been skipping some closets and stuff. Hopefully there's no alien in there. Like, in there or something. That'd be super annoying. For me, not you, because I'd just skip it. There he is! I found him. Um... Help. I don't know if that's the one, or just one of them. I don't know. Oops. Probably save ten minutes for snapshot, just in case I do find something. Yeah, I'm just down to like four people though. Squad leader gone berserk. <gasps> That's him. He knocked himself out. Ha 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 ha. Yes. Probably one of the best finishes I've ever had. Oh my gosh. 27 kills. 13 corpses. 2 corpses recovered. Only 7 artifacts. 7 civilians saved. This was probably one of my best ship terrors I've ever had. Lots of casualties though.